Now, Pakistan ISI's imprint is writ large over the new Taliban government. The ISI's pick, Mullah Khund, is now the Prime Minister of the Islamic Emirate of Afghanistan. Key positions in Taliban cabinet are taken by the Haqqani leaders and ISI's close aides. Pakistan is sending out a strong message that the road to Kabul now goes through Islamabad. Mullah Hassan Akhund, the new face of the Taliban-led government in Afghanistan. A man named in the UN terror list. Akhund is not only ISI's top choice to lead Afghanistan, he's also been the head of Taliban's Rahbari Shura. Despite no military or financial muscle, Akhund, a close aide of Haqqani Network, got the Premier's position in Taliban cabinet, relegating Abdul Ghani Baradar to Deputy Prime Minister's post. Pakistan ISI was reportedly suspicious of his independent negotiations with the United States and Afghanistan. Sirajuddin Haqqani, the head of ISI-backed terrorist organization, the Haqqani Network, is the new interior minister of Afghanistan, named in the United Nations terror list and with a US bounty of $10 million. DGISI, Lieutenant General Faiz Hamid, camped in Kabul to ensure the Haqqani network gets to call the shots in Afghanistan. Another Haqqani network leader, Khalilul Rahman Haqqani, an uncle of Sirajuddin Haqqani, is the new minister for refugees in Afghanistan. He too has a $5 million bounty on his head. Haqqani network loyalist, and a suicide bomb expert, Mullah Tajmir Jawad, is the new Deputy Intelligence Chief of Afghanistan. The key position in Taliban cabinet taken by Haqqani network leaders and ISI proxies. With the Haqqani network in control of eastern Afghanistan, from the AFPAC border to Kabul, Pakistan's ISI remains in a dominating position. ISI and the Pakistan strategically have always seen Afghanistan uh, for their strategic space and strategic depth. No wonder that they have gone and interfered in Afghanistan in such a big way. Actually, they are looking at divide and rule amongst the terrorist group. It's not just Pakistan's ISI, but even its foreign minister Shah Mehmood Qureshi, who's holding a meeting with foreign ministers of countries in the region, including China, Iran, Tajikistan, Turkmenistan and Uzbekistan to seek support for a Taliban government. But Pakistan's meddling in Afghanistan's internal affairs is being opposed by the people of Afghanistan. Women in Afghanistan have taken to the streets to protest even the presence of the ISI chief in Kabul. इस सिचुएशन में फैज अमीर का आने का मतलब क्या है? मतलब क्या है? फोकस देने के लिए क्योंकि ये तालिबान को बोलते हैं ये करे वो करे। हमारा लीडीज जेंस मर रही है, बकरे के तरह जवाब हो रही है। With Lieutenant General Faiz Hamid in Kabul and Shah Mehmood Qureshi holding meetings with foreign ministers in the region, Pakistan is trying to send across the message to the world that the road to Kabul goes through Islamabad. Bureau Report, India Today.